Yeah, yeah, Japan doesn't have a AC. Yeah, in, in their schools, we, we didn't have AC, man. Nope, it's only the teacher's room. And maybe, if you're lucky, some of the prefectural schools might have AC. Bro, with the humidity, I mean, you're probably looking at cooking maybe damn near... 100 plus man 105 with the humidity like it gets hot as fuck especially where i was in uh in kyushu like more southern um luckily i worked for some prefectural schools meaning like they're they're like ran by the local government right like the the, the state board of education um so they get a little bit more funding than a lot of the private schools so some of the schools i worked at were like implementing ac but bro, they didn't know this must how be what to put happened that shit on, man. Uh, Ethel, were you in Jets? Yeah, yeah, I was in Jet, man. Uh, now, with Jet, you don't get guaranteed that you work at prefectural schools. Because if you work in elementary, then you're going to be working at the city schools. Um, which are usually a little bit shittier than the prefectural schools. Uh, which is like junior high and high schools. Uh, so, working in the prefectural schools, you usually have like more stuff. And it's a little bit nicer. But it's still kind of shit. Uh... So we would have we would have AC in like random ass rooms, but then other rooms they just never bothered to put them in. So yeah, you're you're gonna be teaching a class in he like. My now I I I worked in like uh, it was kind of like an all girls like high school. Um, and dude, oh my god, I'll say this much, man, the girls sometimes smelled worse than the boys in the middle of summer. Holy fuck, that shit was rank as hell, bro. And there was maybe 30, 40 girls in this class. No AC. Oh my God, bro. That was actual hell. And it's just like yip, yip yapping and just fucking talking the whole time. Because it was kind of like a, a lower level school. It was like more of a technical kind of school. So a lot of the girls there weren't too interested in learning English. Uh... So, man, in August, September, bro, I wanted to fucking die, man. God, it was fucking awful. Because, like, these these are, like, teenage girls, man. They're fucking psychotic, dude. They were fucking weird sometimes. God, bro, I, my, my whole job was just to just not not look any of these kids in the eyes because they were fucking crazy sometimes holy fuck and it was bro sometimes it would oh my god this was the fucking worst dude it would rain in the morning and then the rain would go away and then it would be full force heat in the middle of the afternoon and i had this one afternoon class that i would go to bro it, it legitimately felt like i was in a microwave in a microwave, but with like 40 girls just talking about just, I mean, just just about anything. And you're just up there like trying to play telephone on the board and no one's fucking listening at all. Oh my God. It was the one time I was like, bro, I, I hate this job so much. Luckily, it was just that one class. All my other classes with the girls at that school were, were really nice. They were really cool. You just sometimes will get like one really rambunctious class. Um, and it just so happens that that class did not have fucking AC. Girls stink and they're crazy. But no, I, I mean, I, I, I'm not saying all girls, right? I'm not saying all girls. I'm just saying those particular girls in that case. Yeah, the damn, the, the ground starts sweating, man. Mm-hmm. Old ass building where you either have difficult... Retrofits and uh, mini splits or central air or shove in a bunch of window portable units. Yeah, we, we never had window units or anything in Japan. Uh, it was like, uh, God, what was it? It was like this big fucking tower. I, I'd never seen anything like it. It was like a portable AC unit. It was like a gigantic fucking tower that was like uh, probably as tall as the damn chalkboard. It, I'd never seen anything. So if you got lucky enough, you'd have a classroom that would have one of those. But, um, I mean, I don't know. That's probably one in five. A swamp cooler. Is that what they're called? Yeah, I'd never seen one before. The ones with the hoses? Yeah, yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah. I, I'd never seen that shit before. It's like a towered AC portable units. 